Hey guys, it's Jimmy and welcome back to our anime reaction. Today we're reacting to episode 7 of the Eminence in Shadow Season 2. That is right. If you guys did not know, last week we watched episode 6, and in that episode we got to see the fight between Alpha and John Smith and the whole betrayal between them. And we left off that episode knowing that yeah, Alpha and the Shadow Garden have been betrayed by John Smith, and I wonder how that's going to affect the Shadow Garden in today's episode and what's going to go on with that. We do know the last episode that they did, uh, Shadow did write a note to her about something. It was enciphered like in three different languages or something like that, which is absolutely insane. So the question is here today, what will that note actually mean and what's going to happen in today's episode? And I'm just super excited to get right into it because I want to see what happens next. But if you guys do enjoy my anime reaction here today, make sure to smash the like button, get subscribed so you don't miss on future anime reactions because we're trying to hit to what is it like a thousand subscribers before the end of the year so if you do my favor very much appreciated and of course i will be breaking this down for youtube so if you do want the full link reaction consider supporting my patreon get full link reactions exclusive anime reactions and so much more but for right now though let's get into it so it looks like we're zooming off of everyone in the economy a little bit annoyed because of the fact that the value of their money has inflated so it looks like they're trying to take out money or something like that that's probably what they're trying to do right now because that's how like uh what was it where the economy was at one point that's like that my assumption based on everything and it looks like everyone's just like upset that uh you know shadows betrayed them and stuff and of course poor alpha's just in the corner dude she's probably hurt the most out of all of them dude because she was the uh, first one he saved and she was like her right her right hand man his right hand man if that makes sense it looks like the cult might be redeeming their money that they're missing out on so it looks like they're going by all the banks to pull out all those gold as they have their money they can pull out because a bank can't contain every single everyone's single money right and of course it has to be stockpiled somewhere else so like pulling all the money out of every bank is gonna upset the people bro and of course it looks like they figured out who's behind it bruh this guy is just like bro of course, it's like not coincidence that she's coming back to get him. Bro. What do you, he's like, is he seeing all the people of the dead or like what's going on here? Oh no, I think he's sensing everyone around him. He sees her. Bro's actually somewhat scared. Poor Alpha, bro. Oh, poor Alpha, dude. Bro, I think it's much more deep. like they failed his expectations, bro, but it's not that, dude. Oh, she feels so betrayed. Huh? Wait, what? So she, they know the cow was about to put money in the circulation. Then the car, then he knows she realizes now that the cult put he the cult did put bills and he put bills in. Bro, there's, she's starting to connect the dots to like a, a thing that was the, with the cipher note, bro. And you know for a fact that that was not his intent. But it's interesting that she started realizing in that kind of perspective for the plot. And she's so relieved she's not betrayed. What does the note say then? That's my question. I'm sorry, but I have to deceive you to turn the traitor. I have a plan to achieve it. I must end must achieve it with a former name, a print print, and the help of accomplice. Wait, what? <laughs> no shot, our boy just wrote all that on a whim and then handed that note to her. 
deciphered in like different languages, dude. What? Oh my god, no shot, dude. That's cap. They're so relieved though. So they're so hyped that they know for a fact that they try to take on our boy Shadow and destroy the whole competition, but Shadow beat them to it. And they're gonna learn from this whole situation so that way they can live up to these expectations next time even more, bro. But like at the same time, too, that's not the point. That's not the point. <laughs> bro. And of course, the location of all the resources is little in the spot where they first saved his sister. They actually don't mention that in this whole part. That's like, that's the whole point of it. They mention that part. And it's funny that they just don't point that out. And Delta's coming back. You just see her little ears. <laughs> Delta's back. Bro, in the manga, it was so different, dude. Originally, in the manga, it was like, they handed the note to her, she understood with the note, but at the same time, too, like, she, they handed Delta, like, a, a, uh, a baby, like, a, to her, because she's like, oh my god, Delta! And she didn't want to spoil the mission for boss, dude. I don't know, they're sort of, like, cute nonetheless, but it's a little bit not comedical, this one. It's a little bit more serious. But, uh... They're all happy to have their puppy back. <laughs> Bruh. Bro, I was hoping to get all the funds for himself, dude, without realizing he's gonna go there, and they realize then all of it's been taken. Bro. He's gonna be livid. Bruh. They, they realize his aura load is pissed. He thinks Gatton took the money, bro. These girls just know he's uh, livid. Dude, getting tonight I say a chance. The misunderstanding between the two is actually on sanity. <laughs> Bro is livid. You just see the atomic coming out of him. Are we actually gonna fight scene between the two of them? Huh. Oh he is getting stomped. Bro, can you just see people's power? Looks like like her whole aura and stuff like that. It's a giant power. So unfortunate. Oh, he took a pill. Okay. Oh. Bro just recovering and got in uh what the hell? Bro just got one of those eyes from before. It looks like he's getting trauma from the events he did in the past. Well that's gotta that's gotta hurt big time. Oh, here we go. Music kicks in, boys. Oh, 
Dude, I just don't get the whole eye thing. I thought he got one of those things from Naruto. I forgot the name of them. Uh, the red one. If you guys want to call what it is, I, I don't I don't watch Naruto, but I did know the name of it. However, I kind of forgot. Bro. Bro singing about the girl, but he's talking about the gold that he stole, and he doesn't realize it's like a misunderstanding between the two, bro. Dude, they're gonna destroy that whole forest. Actually, wait, they're in a park, right? Because this is right outside of the city. Oh, I just know the park's gonna be eradicated. Bro, she's the thing. These are reliable men, man. They're just going right through her. Bro just got eviscerated. Oh my god, dude. Oh my god, it's teeth! Oh my god! My guy is... My guy is just gone, dude. My guy is just gone. Looks like he's trying to force him to talk. And I think he misunderstands that as like the confess your love like he used to be. But uh, him is more like his money's been taken. But can I just say the, the way he got hit in the face? I was not expecting that. I was just expecting a normal punch. But a, a kick, drop down kick to the mouth. I was not anticipating at all. Like, sweet God, man. Oh, yeah, so he's the monster from Be Sorry You Saw. This misunderstanding soon as the bandits that attacked the village. That the bandits like took away everything, but he stopped the bandits, but at the same time too, he's he if he had more power to be able to save them. Oh well he's dead, buddy. It looks like he left her him to her the him. What the hell? Dude. Oh my god, he's just gonna kill her with it. Well, all the scars are gonna be completely gone, dude. Everything's gonna be cleared. Looks like she realizes too that he's the bandit that stopped him from uh, massacring them any for any further. Dude, the whole there's still a bunch of like loose ends they don't talk about because lately they make him seem like he's the bad guy who destroyed the village, but it was literally the bandits moved by the cult, and like th there's like kind of missing. Bro's burying the guy. I think he's trying to look up for the treasure he was looking for. Looks like they're trying to show all the gold to the economy so that way they can prove that their trust. And that's a way to prove trust to the economy market so they know like their money's in good hands. They just want to make sure that the economy knows like, hey, we have your money, do not worry about it falling. You know what I'm saying? So they have the trust of the people back. So looks like they're going to work together. So it looks like they're the the fox and her are gonna work together. That's funny, dude. And he was looking for the gold for gold. Wait, is he throwing the stone on the guy's body? Wait, tell the swift him too? What's the whole Bro? Oh, 
Oh my god, they're just digging a hole together, dude. It looks like he's gonna help her with uh, his uh her promise, bro. Bro, why are you talking about Santa Claus in bad light, brother? Oh, bro, he's always really concerned about having a kid, so mess up all of his plans, dude. If he has a kid, it will mess up his plans big time. So that's why he doesn't have an inner uh, relationship with anyone because he messed mess it up. What did Delta find? What? What did she find? Boss is gone and she found something. What did she find? What did she find? You can't just end off the cliffhanger like that, bro. So that was the Emmons of Shadow episode. What is it? 17. Gatrin did not stand a chance, dude. I love how the whole thing is like, we get to see how, how the Shadow Garden's happening and, and like, they're all like, oh no, he's betrayed us, no. And it's interesting that like, they, she finally connects the dots to that. The call is going to put counterfeit the money in the economy. And then he did it first that way. They they were going to get negatively impacted by it because he could control the situation. And it's like kind of like a, a five step ahead kind of scenario thing. And in all reality, our boy is just trying to get the money for himself. And that way he can just do his thing, right? But then it's, and then they get the note and they're like, oh my God, it's deciphered. And I don't know how in heck they, it, they describe the, all the languages just to get that message. Etta must be the biggest IQ person all in the world to solve that, which is just hilarious. But literally they figure it out and they know Delta's not out dead either. And of course their boy John Smith goes to fight, of course, Gatrin and just because he's like, oh, you have something precious, uh, you, you took it away and stuff like that. And he's, he thinks he's talking about the girl because she like, he originally liked her. But the reason why it, it went, everything went astray was because the cult was pulling the strings and influencing him behind the scenes until he went to the opposite direction. So he always did love her, but he kind of straight away so far that it's just he just couldn't stand it anymore upright and he just had to be put to rest so our boy there's the meanest drop kick and i mean the meanest to the point where like his his bottom part of his mouth is just absolutely eviscerated but god man he finally tells her like he just basically implies you're my precious and stuff like that and he thinks that the gold's that direction right and can i just quickly say what did delta find what did delta find that's my question was it a present was it something he was looking for who knows is it more gold i'm not entirely sure but I, that'll be something we'll have to figure out next episode i don't think we'll honestly figure it out because i don't think there was anything in the manga that happened with that bit if light novel readers or webtoon readers or anyone out there what the hell did she find <laughs> i don't recall anything in the manga about that bit but uh yeah that was that was a good episode though nonetheless and of course dude can i just quickly say it i love how that the whole sequence at the end they got delta and him working like in the dig up snow you can see like the physical prowess difference in the snow piles to him just like talking to her about stuff like that and saying he can't give her away whatever she wants because he isn't like santa claus and it looks like he didn't get really much from santa claus because he's just like he treats him as like a demon lord or something like that. Uh, like, man, Del Santa's got a bad rep with Sid for some reason. That is definitely something to say the very least. But yeah, I mean, he's more concerned about though. He'd actually have to give something to Delta. And he doesn't like, he like laid out all the things needed to say. You, I don't, you can't, it can't be something that takes too much effort. That can't cost too much and all this other jazz. And look, she wanted the sauce. She wanted the secret stuff she wanted the spice and he knows for a fact that he gives her that having a baby can have problems they can really stir up all his plans she just doesn't try to have a relationship with anything one he tries to do his own thing like a lone wolf and not be bothered but still dude it's like bro bro like dude you know delta's down bad she wants to have a hundred and you know alpha wouldn't mind you know she's a she's the fangirl you know what i mean and then everyone else is like 
You know what I'm saying? But at the same time, too, our boy's just like, he isn't that kind of guy. But, you know, if they ever did ask, he ever did ask for it, you know, he could do it. And maybe I am a freaking atomic, if you know what I mean, if you know what I mean. But, like, inner circle, if you don't know what I mean, do not, do not look up. I am freaking atomic because you might discover something you not want to see but besides the point though today was a great episode and I, that's all i have to say about it and, and of course did you enjoy my reaction here today make sure to smash like button get subscribed so you don't miss on future anime reactions and i'll see you guys in another one g-man out